Pat Croce, the former president of the Philadelphia 76ers basketball team and self-confessed pirate buff, believes that his team of international explorers from the likes of Britain, Panama, Australia, France, Scotland, and Colombia are close to locating the watery grave of the British naval hero Sir Francis Drake. Croce financed the expedition to the coast off Panama in order to hopefully locate the final resting place of Drake. The team is equipped with some of the most sophisticated equipment available and has located the ships Elizabeth and Delight. They believe Drake's lead-lined coffin is nearby. Croce said, it's truly a needle in a haystack, but so were the ships. We found them within a week. We just haven't found him yet. Croce continued, explorers have been trying to do this stuff forever. And here I am, a homeboy from Philadelphia in the Caribbean, and we score. It's pretty wild. Speaking about the ships, Croce said, There was no treasure on board, as they were stripped prior to being scuttled by the crew. Sir Francis Drake died from dysentery at the age of 55. He was buried at sea in a lead-lined coffin, wearing his full set of armor. Drake is considered a British naval hero having led the English Navy to victory over the Spanish Armada in 1588. Drake was also the first Englishman to circumnavigate the globe. James Sinclair, a marine archaeologist, said, We've really, I feel, hit a home run here with what we found with Pat. Sinclair added, Finding ship structures from that time period in this temperature of water, with the type of organisms that exist, is a treasure in itself. I found the information for this video at Mail Online. The author is, Paul Thompson, and you can find a link to it on my blog at www.treasurebone.blogspot.com. If you come across some interesting treasure or archaeology news, or have any interesting finds of your own, let me know about it. You can email me at treasurebone at gmail.com, or there's a link to it right there on my blog. Well, that's all I have for now. As always, take care and happy hunting. Bye.